They thought he was just an ordinary narrow border. But underneath all that boring exterior and scruffy appearance, he was narrow boat will. Previously, we passed through Faisley along the Birmingham and Faisley Canal, and now we're heading to Fratley Junction today in this vlog. It's not for it's not for Faisley, it's but Coventry Canal. I do apologise. So this is still the Coventry Canal. That must be over there somewhere then on the map. I don't know. I can't work this map out. Anyway, we're heading to here today, and it's cold. That's that's it. That's all you need to know. Thank you. And good night. Can you see that? Can you see the, the um, how it's ice has formed on that solar panel? Check. Yeah. Week or two? I'm in no hurry because I can't get through Adelaide and Audland. Boat sails here as well. Yeah. Just going up, just walking up to check to see if there's any moorings further up. We're just down yeah, there uh, getting water. He says when he went at the top two days hey. ago, there's only two boats there. Right. Look at that park in there, look, Rip Yeah, little... Press here for more about the water channel. Oh, it's not telling us. Oh, it's not charged enough, probably. Middle lock. Yeah, yeah, here's middle lock. <laughs> Trenton Mersey Canal Company dug this open channel to carry water above middle lock to Fradley Pool. This stopped the water going into the Coventry Canal. The channel must be down here somewhere. Ah. Oh, the channel's here. Ah, look at down there, look. Oh, lovely. It's a memory of Valerie Jean Griffiths. <laughs> Much loved wife, mother and canal enthusiast. 1943 to 2004. Swing bridge dedicated to her. got some water we filled up and now that lovely lady there is going to do the swing bridge for me and we're turning left there's two locks to do and then we're going to rest up at the top we're going to moor up next to the bank hopefully it's open with a good signal oh there she's she swung the bridge for me bless her dead easy that wasn't it This chap's turning round. There's a boat behind me, he's coming up behind me. Down there, look, Rip this. We're all going up the locks. Bloody Nora. Come down, nobody about a minute ago. Everyone and their granny's out. Almost there. Go on now, kid. Give it some stick. There you go. There he goes, he's off. Right. chap here look he's going to go up the locks and then we're going to go up and the boat behind's going to go up lovely junction this there's bins just down there there's bins water uh owl sand and all that kit and caboodle so you've got short you got short low down there great hayward this way and then coventry that way there which is nice He's got his locks set ready for him. He's going to go straight in. And we're going to wait down the bottom. There's two locks in succession here. To set one and walk up to the next one, yeah? It is bloody chaos. Somebody going in, somebody coming down. We're going up. Somebody behind us going up. What the hell? Yeah, give her up. This chap's going out. The next chap's coming in. There's a boat down there waiting to come in behind us. We're coming in. The chap down there is waiting to come in. Right now, Leon's got to come in. He's done his business now, a little chin wag. I love these lock chin wags. Get to know a lot really quickly, don't you, about a person? There he goes, look, he's off ripping. What 
We're in now. He's just going to go and set the next one. My boat keeps surging. This is a little bit worrying. Surging then. He went, ooh. There it. Something not right there, isn't there? I'm not having that. I'll check my oil. I'll check my oil. There you go, look. Might be the inverter actually. Second lock of the day. It's taken us a while to get up these locks, but it's finally getting there. This one's set, the one's just set it. Into this one, more at the top. Day done. We've moored here. I'm going to go and help. Oh, my lens. My lens has gone a bit funny. That's better, isn't it? We'll smudge on it or something. I'm going to go and help Mike come up the locks. He doesn't like being filmed, so I'm not going to film him. That's because it's uh, swift. I'm not going to stop us all the repairs. Another cold morning. Look at that beauty. I'll tell you what, it's hard to get these bloody ropes in. For them to move really quick this morning because there's no signal. Zero. The arm can't even work. So we're moving just further up a little bit. Oh, that's good, the lock's set. We're on the hunt for a signal. My neighbour, Mike, he said he's got a perfect signal. He's on the same company as me, EE. He's got a perfect signal and we've got nothing. I'm trying to upload, I'm trying to upload a vlog. I just, I just, I've put, I've, I've, I start, oh. Get your words out, Will, bloody hell. We had one coffee. I tried to upload last night at, uh, 10 o'clock I started uploading when I went to sleep and this morning I woke up and it only done 30% that's how bad the signal is and that's stuck in the window so we're moving up trying to find it Leon couldn't work he had to stop work last night uh, oh, difficult isn't it this is it's so annoying because that spot was gorgeous I wanted to stay there this is 53 Leon 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 this is wood end lock, wood end lock number 20. It's so gorgeous this time of year, isn't it? It really is. Oh, it's beautiful. Eight o'clock in the morning, the sun's just coming up. Oh, it's absolutely freezing cold. I know. Oh, I didn't get my marina on when I go past them. Bridge 54. It's like an old pump house here, look. Beautiful old building. Old pumping station, it's gotta be. Wow. Oh, hey, a narrowboat there, look. Rip. Yes. Old workshop. Well, we're gonna hopefully more up here somewhere. It looks very more moorish, doesn't it? it? Looks very moory. King's Bromley Wharf. You are run down. Nationwide boat sales. Look at this. What's it called? This place. King's Bromley Waterside. Oh, hey, look at this. Woohoo! Your beauties. That's a big old man. Look, look at Mr. Van. Look at him. Look. What is he doing here? Come back. Come back from the van. Look at me boat, look, across the canal. Hey, I've thrown the centre rope to you, mate. Oh my God, he's off, isn't he? I know, why has nobody helped us move it back? Look at this, rippers. I was going to move today, but... The canal.
house frozen. No! It's not frozen up there, but I can guarantee there'd be pockets of deep frost. Nice. So I can't move to Roosley today, which is the plan. I've got to meet my daughter. No! I've got to go meet my daughter and near a train station, which is Roosley. I hope it thaws out in a bit. Very beautiful though. Oh, my solar's frozen, you get no solar. Blue tits robins. Talking to that couple down there about the uh, about life on the canals, really. On Litchfield, they reckon they put some electric points in for electric boats. I mean, it makes sense, but the grid the grid's not set up for it. They can't handle it. There isn't enough power in the grid to power all these electric things, is there? And the range is rubbish. On this new electric van, seventy thousand, I think they are. They do one hundred and sixty-six miles. What the freaking hell use is that? Wait a minute, what use is that Ripith? My van does 700 miles on the tank. So I'm going to go up, go up to, from here, go to Scotland and back almost. But on the van, 160 miles. Just charge it about 10 times to get there and back, wouldn't you? Imagine being delivery service. <sighs> Can't make it in, he's charging. How's it going to be? Well, I don't know, he's got to wait because there's everybody else queued up. Oh, this system we've got is rubbish. Thank you. Well, good night. Look at these gorgeous trees, look. Oh, covered in fro. I hope the canal's not frozen in places, you know, as I've stuffed it. I've just left a good spot. Bridge 55. And you can park just here. Parking. Oh, can't even hold the camera, it's so cold. A boat, a boat went past earlier, so I'm hoping that that boat has cleared a path for me, so. Rugely, here I come, Ripper. Oh, isn't that just stunning? Like frozen fog. Wow! Nature, you're bloody gorgeous. There's a bit of ice, but it's very thin. It's very thin ice, you know? Almost wispy, so that's... Oh, look at that tree, look. Wow! Gorgeness, absolute gorge. Hot water, washing, fires blazing. Engine hot, good day.
Armitage, the place of toilets. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing, it's not funny. Place of toilets and Armitage, I think the Germans... Armitage has changed ownership. Germans have bought it now, like everything else in this country. Germans have bought the company. Um, but they're still good. I think Bosch might have bought it. Is Bosch German? Somebody's telling me. Um, so the Armitage is still there. Armitage is still there, Ripith. But um, yeah, this is Armitage. This is the area of Armitage. That's what I'm trying to say. It's not been too bad so far, it's frozen on the edges, but in the middle it's somebody's come past and they've already... Can you hear that? <gasps> so, um... Ah... Oh! Me! What do you, what do you think of these frozen conditions? We've been talking to the dorks. Oh, they said it's cold, did they? Are oh, they managing alright? Oh, that's good then. What do you reckon to it all oh, then? Are cold? Oh, so am I, mate. Bloody freezing. I can't hold this camera. Are we doing a little jiggy? Hey! Well, here we are in Armitage. This is the end of the line now because no one's been beyond there. It's just all frozen. I'm not using my boat to clear it, you know what I mean? I don't mind going down the path that somebody else has caught. I'm hoping that there's some shops here or something. Maybe a bit of parking rippers. Nice little journey. Done the washing. Get the washing done. Got hot water. <coughs> Excuse me. Getting hot water now for a washing. Very pleasant area, isn't it? Seems nice, Ripith. Paths are good. Oh, you and your paths, I know. I like a good path. It's dry. That's the main thing. That's it. End of this journey. Because it's my birthday today. 2nd of December, hey, happy birthday me. Leon's got me a present now, what is it then? Do you want your present now? Yeah, please. A big lump of coal. What? It's a nice one. What is? You're not happy, you're not grateful. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a nice piece of coal, I must admit, look at that, the structure of it. I've never seen raw coal before. Don't you get coal when you're bad? You get cold when you're bad? Yeah, you've been bad at golf. I've been bad at golf, I know I have. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what, I'm going to put that in. Put that in the fire. Even though know, the fire's on, it's red. Sorry, it burns rippers. Oh, I'll turn to the side, look. Sorry, it burns, shall we? Robbie Burns. Burns. There we are. Sorry, it burns. It's not warm in here, is it? No. The fire's on. Yeah. Right, you can't touch the fire, but it's still cold in this like boat. This it's still cold in this boat. It's freezing. Fair, it's really freezing really back there. Really in that freezing cold water. We're submerged in it. It's minus four degrees outside. Bloody freezing. Harry, it's cold. Harry was last night, like, it's cold there. What? Harry messaged me at four in the morning. I was like, Harry, it's too cold to talk to you. <laughs> I couldn't even hold the phone talking to Shiraz. I couldn't even hold the phone talking to you. Thank you for that coal, mate. You're very welcome. Coaly fingers up. <laughs> Let's see how that coal's burning. Ooh, it's burning all right, isn't it? It's got a funny smell to it. I think it's just didn't get into the compressor. It must get chopped up and then it goes into a compressor. It's ain't warm in here. It's just not warm in this boat, even though the fire's on. Right next to it, it's still bloody cold in here, you know? God, what's that all about? What's me... Oh, I need a battery for me temperature sender thing, sensor. <sighs> Bored, people. My birthday, there's nothing to do. Bored. Let's have a quick look uh, at Armitage. Hey, Rippers. What does Rippers mean? Oh, it's, it's an Australian term for finding a gem. So... Subscribe. Instead of saying subscribe, I'll say Ripith. Nice little house. Look at that lot. There's parking here, lot, eh? Come on. That's a parking spot for me, our kids. Look at that glare. You just, if you're driving, you can't see a thing. 
you cannot see a thing. The road blinds you, the sun blinds you, you've got two blinding elements. Wow, I mean I can't see up there. The crown, as you can see there, just stopped on the edge of the ice. thick there doesn't it no one's been through this is Armitage bus stop there so it's the home of toilets oh, very nice where do you come from home of toilets Oof. Mm, sounds posh got the royal crown ah oh, that's better funny shaped house isn't it like an extension weird isn't it Don't like to go on, but it's because my birthday. I'm going to treat Leon to some fish and chips for lunch. Wait a minute, it's supposed to be the other way around. Yes, it bother me. Another day, isn't it? Every day's a birthday for me. This sort of lifestyle, even though it's freezing cold, you know, it's just stunning. Still, looking at the wildlife, little robins and and the little blue tits, whatever. Right, let's get some fish and chips out, kids. This mill post was donated in loving memory of Cheryl, who died on 19th of May, 1978, aged 26. Oh, it's beloved daughter of Mr and Mrs MacDonald, Hardy. Oh, heartbreaking, isn't it? Hardlow, 29 miles. Prestonbrook, 63 miles. What a heart, 20, 26. 26 years old, nothing in That's nothing. Oh, imagine that. 26, like my Leon now or my Bradley. Bradley's 29 ish. Oh, Katie's the youngest. Her age. Oh, the heartbreaking, wasn't it? No one put memorial there. A lot must have been heartbroken. You can see these sad things, don't you? I'm walking back for Mr. Van now mile and a half. Uh, tell you what, boots keep building up with mud underneath, you know. It's like wearing high heels after a bit, you get high taller and taller as, you, as you're walking along. <laughs> I want to show you something, Rippers. Spray that mud guard. I've done that fork seal on that motorbike. I'll show you outside. I didn't even lock up last night. I didn't even lock up, Rippers. Look at this lot. Ah, oh, they beautiful lot. The trees are raining snow. Wow. Oh, the poor. Sorry, I'm not feeding you. Sorry. They must be hungry. Ah, oh, a winter wonderland! Yay! <laughs>